And have you ever wondered how the Ethereum to Bitcoin ratio has been performing lately? Well, it seems that there has been some interesting growth in the last week. In fact, the ratio reached the new highs after BlackRock, um, a major asset management giant, filed for an exchange-traded fund for Ethereum. Uh, for the past year, the ETH to BTC ratio has been on a decline, reflecting the decrease in the values of ETH and other altcoins. However, uh, things took a turn when news of BlackRock's filing became public. Since then, the ratio has witnessed a reversal, increasing by 10% since the application was made on November 9th. Uh, following the filing, ETH has experienced a significant surge in trading volume across centralized exchanges and daily spot trade volume reached seven billion dollars the highest level since the collapse of cryptocurrency exchange FTX in November 2022 additionally the increased trading activity has pushed the price of ETH above two thousand dollars for the first time since April uh, not only has ETH's trade and volume increased but the altcoin market share has also rallied since the BlackRock filing uh, according to a report by Keiko, uh, the market share of the altcoin plus ETH volume uh, relative to BTC has risen to 60%, uh, its highest level in over a year. As the price of ETH continues to grow, participants in the futures market have shown increased demand for leverage, expecting a continued price rally. ETH's open interest has recovered to levels seen before the market-wide liquidation event in August reaching $7.17 billion at press time. It's interesting to note that the coin's funding rates have also surged to their highest levels in over a year, indicating a positive sentiment among market participants. Crypto exchanges are seeing only positive funding rates for ETH since October 1st, suggesting that traders are placing bets in favor of a sustained price rally. And, um, so if you're wondering whether your portfolio is green, you might want to check out the ETH Profit Calculator. And now for a short joke about the subject, why did the cryptocurrency go to therapy? Because it had some serious altcoin plexes. And with that said, thanks for watching, and until next time.